Hi guys. So, we are going to do obliques. Oh no, obliques. Um, these are tough, uh, very hard. You can stop wherever you want to and I'll say try to get to here. And then this is sort of how to advance. I'm not gonna do all the variations, but I am gonna do um, a number of them. These are tough. Um, the big thing to remember is to keep the arms going. Um, so what um, I'm going to do, um, you're trying to eventually come into a point where you don't need the ball coming into flexion. Um, I'm going to be using a ball. So some things that you guys might not know about me is when I was born, my neck is slightly off a little bit. So coming into flexion, no matter what I do, and I like to say I have a pretty strong core. Um, I can't get out of my neck in a certain way and then I get a headache. So I'm going to use the ball, which is great because then it shows you how to use the ball as well. The big thing, and I'll show you placement on it, the big thing is that to make sure the ball matches your eyes. No, I'm kidding, but it's kind of cool that it does match my eyes. So um, you need your handles, okay, and we're going to be using one handle at a time, so we do one side at a time. Um, we're going to be going to, um, um, you can do it on a blue and a white, or you can do it on a red. Now, sometimes lighter is easier, sometimes heavier is easier. So you have to find what works for you, what keeps you out of your neck and into your abdominals, okay? So we're going to go ahead. I'm going to lie down. You want to make sure that your headrest is at at least half because when you lift and lower your head off the ball, if you don't, the ball will roll off the back. We don't want that to happen. So we're gonna go ahead and lie down. And you put the ball under the skull, okay? So it doesn't go, I'll pull the shoulder rest out. Maybe, there we go. So it doesn't go in your neck because then you're gonna be looking up. And that's what we're trying to not do. So you want to make sure the ball is under the skull, maybe I can get the shoulder rest back in. We'll see. <laughs> Look at that. <sighs> okay, so we're going to grab the right handle first. Okay, now your alignment. Again, so you want to make sure, see how I moved it out so my arm can get properly aligned so I don't yank on my shoulder. You press up. Make sure that the handle is not in your fingers and that you're not letting your wrist cave back. So you're reaching through the fingers and the arm is up. Now you're gonna take the other arm and you're gonna put it into it and you're gonna rotate your torso over to the right. Now, you're gonna go try to stay in neutral with the pelvis if you can. You're gonna bring the legs up into tabletop and then take them to the left. Ready? We're gonna go in five. So you're gonna press one and up, two, and up, keep your elbows straight. Three, good, keep your eye line to your thighs. Four, good, and five, good. Now pressing and lifting. And down, two, and down, three, and four, good, and five, and stay up for five. And two, and three, and four, and five. Now let the head come back down. Now you're going to add the feet. One. And two. Three. Four. And five. And keep them straight. And one. And two. Sink the belly in. Three. Reach through the legs. Four. And five, good, lifting and lowering the head. One, and back. Two, and back. Three, four, and five. Stay up for five. And two, and three, and four, and five. Now, this is where you can stop, right? Try to get to this point. Okay, so now what you're gonna do, you're gonna come up, split the legs, and press through center. Up, take the legs back over, press to the hip. Up, split the legs, press through center. 
Up, legs together, press to the hip. Up, split. Up, together. Up, split. Up, together. Now, up, split, and stay here. And lots of other variations that you can do. Have fun with it. Make sure that you try to first start with the head down. That's why the ball is nice because you get a feel for it. You can actually figure everything else out. If you saw when I went wide, I could easily go wider, um, but I just had to sort of figure it out with the movement and everything. The big thing, keep the arms going. You're going to get a good burn. Um, make sure that you do both sides. I'm going to do the other side now. Um, I might cut it off depending on how long the video is. A lot of things don't like long videos, so maybe I should stop talking so much. <laughs> okay, so I'm going to try it. Lifting and lowering my head. Hang up. Head down at the legs. Legs stay up. do it. 